Hi friends, I'm making this short uh, video about um, how to use a simple digital gauge and a mobile uh, compass to find deep sky object using uh, altitude and azimuth uh, coordinates. So as you can see, uh, I have a digital uh, angle gauge uh, which is magnetic so I can easily stick it onto the Dobsonian uh, body. And at the same time, I have uh, my uh, secondary mobile and I'll be using the Compass app uh, there. Uh, but before I go into the details, the first thing first, uh, so we need to see if uh, the daub is sitting on a perfectly horizontal. So I'm using this uh, bubble gauge and as you can see, it's perfectly horizontal. The bubble is in the middle and uh, so i will be now resetting uh, the digital angle meter uh, angle gauge to zero uh, which you can see it's um, already at zero i'll just uh, slide it a little bit and check uh, in other places so that's fine it's a little bit of 0.2 degrees elevation here but that's okay one point this uh, this cage is um, not a very uh, high costly item so uh, it doesn't uh, uh, you know refreshes very fast so you have to be a little patient in terms of uh, when the coordinate updates so this gauge will give us the altitude uh, of the celestial object and for azimuth coordinates, we will be using uh, the Compass app on my mobile. So let's start uh, the app. Here we have it. So from the past experience, I can tell you if I uh, place it um, just here, it will be exactly aligning uh, with the with the direction where the telescope is pointing. So the deviation is less than one degree. So that's that's acceptable for my uh, my finding. As you can see, uh, it will tell you the azimuth coordinates uh, when you are uh, rotating the telescope so now what you can do is you can use any uh, app uh, like sterilium uh, whichever object you are interested in get the real-time uh, altitude and azimuth coordinates and using these gauges you can point it roughly uh, towards that object now one thing to note here is since uh, these uh, instruments will not exactly be precisely aligned with the direction of the telescope so there is little bit of uh, um, manual uh, I would say scouting that you have to do for fine tuning the exact object. Thank you. If you like my videos please like and subscribe.